Hello, friends. Hope you're doing great. So, we are discussing about IELTS. Today, I am going to tell you about how to fill blanks. I mean, completing the blanks. Number of words and spelling. Many IELTS test checkers do not correctly complete the blanks. Some test checkers use more than the suggested number of words or they do not spell the answer correctly. If you make these mistakes, you will lose points. Be careful when you complete blanks. You may know the correct answer, but if you don't spell it correctly or you add additional words, you will get a lower score. So, let's get started. Number of words. You have to complete the sentence below. Write no more than three words for each answer in the blank space. I'm going to pronounce the incorrect one. The incorrect one is the scientist discovered a new cure slash treatment. And the correct one is the scientists discovered a cure. The incorrect answer above counts as four words. Four words will count against you. You can use fewer than three words, but you cannot use more than three words. Do not use a slash. Number of words. Again, you have to complete the sentence below. Write no more than three words for each answer. Let me tell you about incorrect one. The scientist discovered a new cancer treatment. The correct one is the scientist discovered a cancer treatment. Spelling. Complete sentence below, write no more than three words for each answer. Let me tell you about the incorrect one. The scientist discovered a cancer treatment, which is written T R E T M E N T, which is incorrect. The correct one is the scientist discovered a cancer treatment, T R E A T M E N T. You must spell the words correctly, a misspelled word will count against you. You can use British or American spelling either. But you must spell the word correctly. Now, we are moving forward. The following statements are not completed correctly. Write the correct answer. Write no more than three words for each answer. Number one. The shelves were filled with fruits and fresh vegetables. The correct one is the shelves were filled with fruits and vegetables. In the incorrect sentence, with is repeated. Fruits is misspelled. The adjective fresh is not necessary to the statement. And there are five words instead of three. Number second, Cynthia lives near to the train station. The correct one is Cynthia lives near train station. If you return a library book late, you must pay a fine of 25 cents a day. And the correct one is if you return a library book late, you must pay a fine of 25 cents. Now we move to the next one. Their trip was spoiled because of they had very bad weather. The correct one is their trip was spoiled because of bad weather. Next, the fountain is in the center of the beautiful sunny roses garden. The correct one is the fountain is in the center of the rose 
girl. Next, students usually can to choose the topic for their essay. Students can choose the topic for their essay, which is correct one. Next, more or less 10,000 of visitors come to the museum each year. 10,000 visitors come to the museum each year, which is correct. Next, if you don't understand the assignment, you should have to ask the professor for help. And the correct one is, if you don't understand the assignment, you should ask the professor for help. Next, Roberto was excited about taking a trip to Alaska. The correct one is, Roberto was excited about trip to Alaska. Next. Many northern songbirds spend the long winter in Mexico. The correct one is many northern songbirds spend winter in Mexico. Let's move to gender and number. The words you write in a blank must match the tense, gender, and number of the rest of the sentence. Don't use a singular verb when a plural verb is required. Don't use a singular noun when a plural noun is required. Don't use a masculine pronoun to refer to feminine or neutral antecedent. You may know the correct answer. But if you don't use correct grammar, you will get a lower score. Verb agreement. Now we move to the verb agreement. Let me tell you about the incorrect one first. The scientist at the research hospital is looking for a cure, which is incorrect. The correct one is, the scientists at the research hospital are looking for a cure. The incorrect answer above uses a singular verb is a plural verb, are, refers to the plural subject, scientists. The singular noun, hospital, is the object of the preposition, at, not the subject of the sentence. Singular plural noun, incorrect. They ordered five shirts. The correct one is, they ordered five shirts. The incorrect answer above uses a singular noun, shirt. A plural noun, shirts, is needed because of the plural number five. So, that's all for today. Allah Hafiz.